Hi, in this video I'd like to demonstrate how one can go about updating a shrink wrap substitute part and the shrink wrap level of detail. So in this uh, scenario I've already gone through the process of making the shrink wrap and so right now I'm in uh, just a generically called shrink wrap blower assembly and I've already simplified it using the shrink wrap command. I've plugged all the holes except an anchor hole that I wanted to keep but I missed some parts and this happens from time to time where we've got some fasteners and washers and holes that I'd like to get rid of. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to edit the shrink wrap feature so that <clears throat> it'll update this part but also the substitute level of detail from the main assembly. So one of the things to watch out for when you're doing this is to actually right click on the um, <clears throat> top one, the main node of the browser, and check for updates. If there are available updates, that seems to prevent it from being able to edit. So I do access run the updates, at least this has tripped me up in the past, and once this update has completed, now I can right click on the blower main. This is the derived or the shrink wrap, and I can edit the shrink wrap assembly. And what it does is it opens the shrink wrap assembly, but also the shrink wrap tool. So now I can come in here and I accidentally forgot the fastener, so I can choose to exclude certain components. Get rid of this fastener, the washers. I'm having a hard time picking the washer here. There we go. So we get rid of those guys. And then I go ahead and hit OK. And what this is going to do is it's going to update that substitute part. And now you can see those fasteners and those holes are gone, which is what I desired. And if we actually open up that assembly, which is here now, and we go to our substitute level of detail, it also has removed the fasteners and the hole. So that's just a quick hit, easy way to update your level of detail and the uh, shrink wrap, I'm sorry, shrink wrap level of detail and the substitute LOD at the same time. So uh, hopefully that helps. If you have any questions or comments, please let me know. Have a blessed night.